we're going to have a baptism. Thank God. We love them. It's the best part of church life together. Front and center. Come on over. God, who is rich in mercy and love, gives us a new birth into a living hope through the sacrament of baptism. By water and the word, God delivers us from sin and death and raises us to new life in Jesus. We are united with all the baptized in the one body of Christ, anointed with the gift of the Holy Spirit, and joined in God's mission for the life of the world. Sponsors, you will be presenting Elias Earl Mislivichek this morning for baptism. Parents, Becca, Griffin, called by the Holy Spirit, trusting in the grace and love of God, do you desire to have Elias baptized into this family of Christ? If so, say, I do. I do. As you bring Elias to receive the gift of baptism, you are entrusted with responsibilities to live with him among God's faithful people, bring him to the word of God and the Holy Supper, Teach him the Lord's Prayer, the Creed, and the Ten Commandments. Place in his hands the Holy Scriptures. Nurture him in faith and prayer so that Elias may learn to trust God, proclaim Christ through word and deed, care for others and the world God made, and work for justice and peace. Do you promise to help Elias grow in the Christian faith and life? Sponsors, Joe and Lauren, do you promise to nurture Elias in the Christian faith as you are empowered by God's spirit and to help him live in the covenant of baptism and in communion with God's holy church? People of God, do you promise to support, <laughs> Marilyn's ready, to support <laughs> Elias and pray for him in his new life in Jesus Christ? If so, say, we do. We do. I ask you to rise as you are able. We are going to confess our faith in the words of the Apostles' Creed found on the screen or in your bulletin. I ask you to profess your faith in Christ Jesus, reject sin, and confess the faith of the church. Do you renounce the devil and all the forces that defy God? I renounce them. Do you renounce the powers of this world that rebel against God? I renounce them. Do you renounce the ways of sin that draw you from God? I renounce them. Do you believe in God the Father? I believe in God the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. Do you believe in Jesus Christ, the Son of God? I believe in Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into the dead. On the third day he rose again. He ascended into heaven. He is seated at the right hand of the Father, and he will come to judge the living and the dead. Do you believe in God, the Holy Spirit? I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Please be seated. Lord be with you. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. Blessed are you, holy God. You are the creator of the waters of the earth. You are the fire of rebirth. You poured out your spirit on your people Israel. You breathe life into our dry bones. Your son Jesus promised to send the spirit to us so the world may know your peace and truth. Pour out your Holy Spirit and breathe new life into those who are here baptized. By your Spirit, adopt us all as your children. Through our Savior, Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Amen. It's the main event, Elias. 
Come on forward. Elias, I baptize you in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, and in the name of the Holy Spirit. Took it so stoically. <laughs> and you get a special towel just for you. <laughs> you belong to Christ Jesus, Elias, in whom you have now been baptized. Alleluia. Let us pray. We give you thanks, O God, that through water and the Holy Spirit you give your daughters and sons new birth, cleanse them from sin, and raise them to eternal life. Sustain Elias with the gift of your Holy Spirit, the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and might, the spirit of knowledge and the fear of the Lord, the spirit of joy in your presence, both now and forever. Amen. Elias, child of God, you have been sealed by the Holy Spirit and marked with the cross of Christ Jesus forever. Amen. We've got a little candle. I'm going to have Gray help me with this part. Jesus said, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will have the light of life. That's for your little brother. And every year on April 7th, you can remind your parents to light that candle to remember this gift of today. Let us welcome the newly baptized. We welcome you into the body of Christ and into the mission we share Join us in giving thanks and praise to God and bearing God's creative and redeeming word to all the world. Let's give a hand for Elias. Welcome officially, Elias, to the family of God found here at Transfiguration. Thank you. Thank you all for being here.